Working again. <laughs> I hate saying that. I love this turbine. But it's up there freewheeling. Got nothing. I own the wires out. They are all open. Got nothing coming down the line, which means that either my uh, slip rings damage, the whole thing burn up all at once, which seems unlikely. Well, I don't know. We're gonna find out. We're gonna bring it down after I finish dropping my nose. I'm a huge fan of this turbine, so I'm sitting out here in the dark trying to figure out what's going on with it. And survey says, da -da -da. these things have been cooking. I've actually pulled the sleeves completely out of that block. I really don't care much for this block. This is the only thing about this turbine that I don't don't like. I don't like this this ceramic block. Man, I cannot get my. It doesn't matter. I think the wires on the output side. Man, they got pretty warm. They split. But that's. That's what we're looking at. Oops. I got my flashlight on it, but not my not my camera. Let's see if I can figure out a way to hold this together. So this is the output side of that block. These wires have melted together a pretty good bit. And then on this side, they're just flat out cooked. Now, something that I have noticed over the last couple of weeks is a little bit of reduced output. And what I'm willing to bet happen is over here, this connection, because those wires were stuck together. They probably shorted out, but the turbine was still running. Uh, most likely, this happened, uh, that stint a couple of weeks ago where the wind was blowing 70 miles an hour. And... Uh, it just progressively got worse and worse and worse. Luckily, easy fix. I do wish that this was number 10 going back here, at least number 10, and not this uh, little stuff. This is a little bit smaller than 10, but we'll be able to snip this apart back here. I'll just get rid of this block. I, I, I had misgivings about this block whenever I first got, when they're even completely missing the screw there. I had misgivings about this block whenever I first got it. Ran with it anyway because I wanted to see how it would run. And this is how it runs. But I guess there's this. Since I've got it apart. Now this is the, uh, the rear of the nacelle. And there is definitely some dirt. And you can see, okay, like this direction going... <laughs> I cannot point... This is the one now. That's the bottom. <laughs> okay. So back here, you can see there's just a little bit of a line where maybe there's an open seam where that the tail is plugged. And it's letting dirt in from the back. Uh, you can also see there's some rub marks there. Which I'm pretty sure that that is from uh, the wires. Just kind of sitting on it. And there is a little bit of a grease mark going along the very bottom. It does look like a lot of the grease has leaked out of that bearing. But it, it does, well, it still turns pretty smooth. And I'm, I'm going to run it until it fails. So... That's that's how that is. Mostly it looks dry. There's no water marks. Uh, so nothing's gotten into it. The back of the motor itself, the generator, that bearing back there still looks super clean. It looks in good shape. It doesn't look like it's had very much dirt or dust or anything get up on it. Uh, my wires here that have been cooked, they've only been cooked back a couple of inches, so they should be all right. Those are on the bottom, which are just set screws. 
I think they're just on the bottom. Yeah, they're just on the bottom. I don't know if you can hear that. But, it makes a little bit of noise, but not much. Whenever the wheel's on it, it starts up super easy. Now I'm going to put this flashlight back in my mouth. Oh no, I guess I don't have to. I can do this. I kind of want to short out these connections and see if it's... Oh my goodness! We'll prop the phone up too. No, it won't. Because I ain't got nothing to prop the phone up on. Uh... Mm, no difference. All right. Gotta put the phone down. Y'all just have to take my word for it. Yep, okay. If I get a good connection there, it starts cogging. So, generator's still good. The line's still good. It just burnt that up. Burnt everything out of the box. So, a little bit of repair work tomorrow. And we stand it back up and should be good to go. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a wonderful evening. Wonderful day. Be good, all that kind of good stuff. Good night.